apologize for our late start with just about 23 minutes gone here in the first half of this encounter between Central FC and Police FC. To many surprise, Police taking an early one goal lead here and we are at the Autobolin Stadium. opportunity here again for police and it's a goal and it's a goal what an upset we are seeing here tonight the favorite is being destroyed here early and it's a goal number two for police Christian Thomas long kick down field by that's Purcell and it's another opportunity here it's an opportunity here it's two against one and uh, and it's good defending and and it's a goal and it's goal number three what is happening here this afternoon it's goal number three from police and uh, my oh my everyone here is stunned in comes the kick straight into the arms of goalkeeper Fonsetti and that's the end of the first half here from the Atabolan Stadium and if you are now joining us we greet you with the news Police FC 3 Central FC 0 I hear so my company Narado Wilson yes uh, the man responsible for the Brazilian link the man responsible for the foreigners who we see every day playing for the different teams in the pro league some of the players that are playing with them um, for example w connection they're having a, an excellent run right so these guys are full 90 minutes every game and give put in the team where they are w connection right now is on top of the league seeing my players with caledonia despite the fact that caledonia is going through a slight slump um they're getting back in gear but i could promise people that from probably this week the following week the other games they would make some changes with the young Winchester, yes, Winchester, one of the new finds in local football, um, all the way from Tobago, and has really stamped his authority since coming over with Central. Um, got, got a recall to the national team, and um, he has performed. It's not that to me, anytime you see Winchester, he might not always score, but he's always, you know giving you a hundred percent and yeah. that's what we need in, in football it, it, it is a player that i it's no secret he has piqued my interest i think it's because he's a young guy mm. tall you know very athletic um very quick player he runs for the 90 minutes just as you're saying he gives you a hundred percent even off the ball his runs are still being made and i think what shocked the league is the fact that he's an unknown player yeah so usually in the pro league there are a few players that get accustomed to some of the plays of other players he was one that i think a lot of defenders didn't expect and they're not accustomed to that type of place so his speed is catching them his physique is catching them off guard and he's something to look at this season a very exciting player because we've seen our strikers have usually been established strikers becoming mm. most goal scorers you know the jocelyn the carry batiste these are guys who have years under their belt yeah. mr winchester for his first season and he's doing he, he's stamping his name as you said the connection the, the, the hot team for the season yeah and they have an opportunity here and can this be goal number one that's Tony oh. Ryan the and a, a shot with the outside of his boot right but good intention I think he used the right foot caught the keep the, uh, his defender off guard but mm. just a bit wide the south land is mm. the football is rich down there so what they basically did and is see an opportunity, see an opportunity here, but a good cross but a bit too strong there yeah no uh, heads they're too strong there yeah, that's winchester again yeah. they're yeah. coming here because they know they want a better opportunity sometimes Actually our local players from winchester what nicely taken there by goalkeeper fonsetti for police still three goals to turn here at the Atabolan stadium I'm, I'm chatting here with narada wilson yeah narada as, as you see yes yeah, uh, so the free kicks are not ready on target let's see what jason mccann is going to do here but we have seen a lot of shots going wide going high yes and he has taken uh, more than three of them already so i think by now he should well he has been taking all the the, the, the kicks uh, again and again he puts and what a miss there and 
he puts it directly to the keeper's hand and fun set <laughs> well I, I i think I, I think that was the the, the the best opportunity that has come um uh, central way thus far um, yeah. they didn't really take advantage of it so no, they didn't the pro league is competitive it is you know because although a team might be beaten tonight you know there is no oh. and it's and a goal. and what a goal no this is a total demolition here uh, and and um, actually we saw central applying some pressure earlier but they never look like scoring but police every time they launch an attack they, they, they look like the chance of scoring i think uh, i think central as the defensive line has made all four of the slip-ups today yeah right yeah. it was three times on the left hand side the first three and now we have a goal coming on the right hand side as i was saying it's it's good to see that they're coming out and we see an attack by police again and he cuts his defender plays the shot that should have been fine yes uh, that's definitely a very good fine. play yeah. caught back on the ball catching his defender leaving him on the ground but i think i think it was a bit selfish because there were two players there, there were options for him. there were options yeah. Yeah. definitely we we continue to see the dominance here of the and you see central team. being caught again would this be goal number f a bit too long a bit and the player doesn't even find his footing so that could, have been, that could have been goal number six and i think the the guy that passed the ball he could have even gone for glory yeah, yeah. central team was responsible for the goals that were scored and we see a player there that i didn't see any contact i think like his shoulder it appears that his shoulder went out of place that because uh, is, that, is that that's Jamal Perry, the substitute player. And he, if you look at the central team too, they are a bit slow too. They are giving the police players ample time. They are. And finally, I see a goal. Was it direct? Was it a ball that came off one of the police players? Well, I, 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 I would like to think so. Yes, because I um, don't think it. You saw the defender and the and the goalkeeper there, and I, I think that uh, that should be um, an own goal. But nevertheless, um, yes, yeah, still um, pretty much in control. Uh, police three, uh, four goals to one actually. Yes, our national goalkeeper. Yeah, that's. Not something John Michael sees. Uh, we come to the end of the game. The end of the match. Police FC walking away with a comprehensive 4-1 win over Central FC.